In the ever-evolving world of graphics processing units, few names have managed to stir the pot quite like AMD's Radeon RX 8800 XT. This upcoming GPU is not just another high-performance graphics card. It's a peculiar beast that challenges conventions and sparks a lot of speculation. As we edge closer to its expected release, whispers and leaks have turned into conversations, and conversations into debates. But the real question remains, what exactly is AMD planning, and why is the RX 8800 XT shaping up to be one of the most unpredictable GPU releases in recent years? Let's dive into what we know, what we've heard, and what might be on the horizon. This isn't just a typical product refresh, it could be something very different altogether. Chapter 1. The Current GPU Market – A Chaotic Battlefield To understand the potential impact and peculiarities of the RX 8800 XT, we first need to set the stage. The global GPU market has been anything but stable. Supply chains have been rattled by lingering effects of the pandemic, global chip shortages, and logistical nightmares. The aftermath has been painful for gamers and professionals alike, with limited availability and skyrocketing prices defining much of the last few years. Chapter 2. Consumer Fatigue and the Price-to-Performance Dilemma There's an increasing disconnect between what consumers want and what manufacturers deliver. Gamers are tired of paying premium prices for marginal performance improvements. While raw power still excites some users, the broader audience is now more aware of power efficiency, long-term value, and actual gameplay experience Chapter 3, A Leap into the Unknown, What Makes the RX 8800 X Weird? There are a few reasons why tech enthusiasts are calling the RX 8800 XT weird, and not in a bad way. For starters, early reports suggest that AMD is taking a slightly different architectural path this time around. While not abandoning RDNA, the 8800 XT is expected to introduce some hybrid innovations that blend traditional rasterization power with AI-enhanced upscaling and improved ray tracing performance. This isn't typical for AMD. Historically, they've lagged slightly behind NVIDIA in ray tracing capabilities and AI-powered features like DLSS. But the 8800 XT seems to be aiming to close that gap, if not obliterate it. Chapter 4. Spec Highlights – The Raw Power Beneath the Surface while the official specs are still under wraps, leaked benchmarks and insider tips hint at some serious hardware under the hood. Rumors suggest the RX 8800 XT may pack over 20 GB of GDDR7 memory, a clock speed that breaches the 3 GHz barrier, significantly improved thermal management using vapor chamber cooling, enhanced ray tracing cores for more immersive lighting and shadow effects, a redesigned die layout for better power distribution and lower heat generation. That kind of hardware hints at a GPU not just built for today's AAA titles, but for what lies ahead, 8K gaming, VR immersion, and the dawn of cloud-integrated rendering. Chapter 5. Performance versus Efficiency – A Balancing Act One of the defining features of modern GPUs is not just how fast they are, but how smart they are about power usage. Power-hungry GPUs may deliver stunning performance, but they often come with excessive heat and energy demands. AMD has been working steadily on balancing performance with efficiency, especially through improvements in their chiplets and power management systems. Chapter 6, 2025 and Beyond, Is It Future Proof? Another important consideration for consumers is longevity. Will the RX 8800 XT be able to handle the software demands of 2025, 2026, and beyond? Based on what's known so far, AMD seems to be investing in future-proofing the card with wide compatibility for DirectX 12 Ultimate, Vulkan API advancements, and emerging standards in virtual reality and machine learning. Chapter 7. What about AI and ray tracing? Historically, AMD has trailed NVIDIA in AI and ray tracing enhancements, but things are changing. FSR, Fidelity FX Super Resolution, continues to evolve and the RX 8800 XT is expected to launch with FSR 4.0 or beyond. These updates bring better upscaling, crisper visuals, and reduced latency, even at high resolutions. Chapter 8, Target Audience – Who's the RX 8800 XT really for? This GPU isn't just for hardcore gamers anymore. AMD seems to be aiming for a broader audience with the RX 8800 XT. Whether you're a game developer, 3D artist, streamer or video editor, the raw horsepower paired with smart software optimizations makes it appealing to multiple user bases. Its ability to power through rendering tasks, handle VR workloads, 
and even support multiple 8K displays makes it a versatile choice. In a world where everyone's working and playing from the same machine, that kind of flexibility is huge. Chapter 9, Virtual Reality, Cloud Gaming, and New Frontiers We can't talk about future GPUs without mentioning where gaming is going, towards VR and cloud-based ecosystems. The RX 8800 XT is rumored to include enhanced support for VR rendering, including foveated rendering and ultra-low latency pipelines for a more immersive experience. As cloud gaming becomes more mainstream, AMD is also expected to provide hardware-level enhancements that benefit remote game rendering and streaming. The RX 8800 XT could serve as a backbone for next-gen cloud infrastructure as well. Chapter 10. The Price Question. Will it be worth it? Of course, everything comes down to one burning question. How much will this card cost? Based on current trends and leaked info, the RX 8800 XT will likely sit in the premium category, perhaps between $800 to $1,000. This price point puts it in direct competition with NVIDIA's top-tier RTX 5090 or whatever flagship card they release next. However, AMD's strategy has historically involved undercutting competitors slightly in pricing while matching or exceeding performance. If they can pull off the same trick with the 8800 XT, it could be a compelling buy for budget-conscious enthusiasts who want flagship-level power. Chapter 11. Software Support and Driver Maturity No GPU discussion is complete without talking software. AMD has come a long way with its Adrenaline software suite, offering intuitive controls, automatic game optimization, and system-wide performance tuning. With the RX 8800 XT, you can expect further integration with AMD Smart Access Memory, Ryzen CPU Synergy, and real-time driver updates that continuously fine-tune the experience. These optimizations can often mean the difference between a smooth ride and a frustrating one. Chapter 12. The Verdict. Strange but promising. So, is the RX 8800 XT weird? Absolutely, and that might be its greatest strength. It's not just a spec bump or a cosmetic upgrade. AMD is clearly trying to redefine what a GPU can be by blending high performance with versatility, efficiency, and futuristic tech. Whether it becomes a smash hit will depend on how well it performs in real-world scenarios, how it's priced, and how it handles next-gen workloads. But one thing's for certain, the RX 8800 XT is not business as usual. It's a curveball, and that makes it exciting. Conclusion. Keep your eyes on this one. As we move closer to its official unveiling, one thing is becoming clearer, the RX 8800 XT might be one of the most interesting GPU releases in recent memory. It promises powerful hardware, smart efficiency, and forward-looking technology all in one.